Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Take a Walk with Me and Garden Update. Today's Tuesday, November 24th. And let's make sure this thing's running. Currently, it's 41 degrees. High today is going to be 56. Uh, rain chance is 0%. Humidity 76%. Uh, there's a little wind, not much. It says six mile per hour. I don't think it's that much. And uh, air quality is 31. That's in the good range. So how is everybody doing today? It's getting closer to Thanksgiving, day after tomorrow. <laughs> so hope everybody's going to have a good time. I know a lot of families aren't going to be able to get together this year. That's that's bad. You know. But uh, today I didn't forget this time. I'll be doing the preview of the review. I'll be showing the things that Logan will be trying tomorrow on Logan's awesome snack reviews. And we've got a good lineup, so check out the preview show. And uh, as always, I do the uh, nutrition facts of all the things that we'll be trying. Because uh, there's just not enough time in the show to do that. Logan likes to talk. <laughs> He's very thorough about explaining everything. So, uh, doesn't have time to do the nutrition facts too. So that's why I do it the day before. Um... I'm almost afraid to say what's for dinner. Every time thing that I say something, it seems like we end up uh, having to have something else. Last night, we just didn't even feel like fixing the salad or anything. We were both tired uh, and everything. So we got to uh, Pals. If you're with me on Facebook, you see in my, uh, I've got three groups on Facebook. If y'all would like to check them out. Chef Mike's Homemade Cooking Club. That's where you'll see the picture uh, of Pals that we got last night. Pals Sudden Service. I got a, a Big Pal with cheese and fries, and Joy got the Junior Pal with cheese, and Logan got a big old chili burger. So it was really good. So we didn't have a salad and pizza last night, so we may have that tonight. I'm not going to say for sure. But <laughs> I don't think I want to go out because we went out to Bob Evans and then we went out last night. So that's about enough of that for a bit. We still got enough for one more time at Bob Evans and one more time. I don't know if it'll pay for all of it at Olive Garden, but we got enough for another time there. So we're going to kind of spread them out a little bit. Uh, um, I need nine more questions to be able to do Ask My Tablet. If you haven't watched the... Uh, last asked my tablet I guess that was yesterday afternoon I did it a little early yesterday because I just wanted to get things done and I had everything ready so I just went ahead and did it early but uh, if you'd like to see one we need uh, nine more questions so leave your questions in the comments as many as you like for ask my tablet I've also got the hashtag two year been here giveaway going on it's my two-year anniversary with YouTube. Uh, I've done, I think I, I, I've tried to really, you know, uh, do a good job to where I could be successful. Um, I don't know if I would say, you know, I, I know I'm successful because of all the friends I've met. That's, that's success to me and all the prayers we put out there and help people through prayer. Uh, you know, so... I've, I have worked hard. I've got about, let's see, by now I probably got about 200 and, how much was it? It said 280,000 views, I think. And I've got over a million watch time minutes already. So that was a big goal for me. I've watched my minutes. You know, I should, would check the, the, you put it on lifetime minutes to find out how much you, total minutes you've had. And I would check it every now and then. The last time I checked it, it said 850,000. 
And then when I checked it the other day, it was uh, something like a million seventy thousand some minutes. So I'm, I'm kind of proud of that, and I am proud of all the views too. Uh, that's a lot of views, so I appreciated everyone so much. But anyway, uh, the prize for the giveaway is a Dollar Tree gift card. Um, I don't know if we're going there today or not. I don't think Joyce's not feeling too good. Her neck's hurting her. She just took some, uh, some Tylenol gel caps or something like that for it. Maybe it'll help. Uh, but you, uh, the rules are you must be subscribed, press the like button, and in your comment put hashtag two year been here, all one word, <coughs> to be entered. YouTube has nothing to do with it, and it's only available in the U.S. So, I hope everybody will enter. And the drawing is going to be this Friday. I didn't want to do it on Thanksgiving. Thought I'd do it the day after. So I hear it sounds like a street cleaner. Yeah. Let's watch the street cleaner going out through here. It's either that or one of the. I, well, we'll see it when it comes down. It's parking up there. It must be the one for the leaves, not the street cleaner. Because it's got a bed on the back of it. And the street cleaner is like a big old Zamboni thing like they use on <coughs> ice skating. Well, it was a hard frost last night, y'all. I looked out and I was like, well, dang. Plenty of frost on the ground. You can see, I'll show you in a minute, I believe there's ice over there in the bird bath. But everybody looks great. Uh, I don't think as much is getting eaten on the holes that you're seeing back there have been there for a long time. Uh, so I'm hoping it's getting cold enough overnight to stop these slugs from eating. The broccoli doesn't look like it's hardly had any, any at all eaten on it. Or the beets. These radishes are starting to come up pretty good. I'm glad I got some more crimson. Those are crimsons, I think. Yeah, that's it. Turnips look great this morning. Mm. These are starting to look pretty good. These French French breakfast radishes. And the spinach is coming up pretty good here. A couple carrots. They're white ones. Yeah, that's what that is. It's picking up leaves. Okay. Oh, that's vacuuming the. That's running along the gutter, or whatever you want to call it. I guess not gutter, but you know, the edge of the road. It's vacuuming. But that's the one they use for the leaves. A couple of these onions look fairly good. The collar looks. The collars are coming back after eating off of them. And these rows here look fairly well. I'm still not going to thin them yet. Like I say, not many birds. Oh, there's one. Oh, is that that? It's going to go for the uh, suet. I saw the woodpecker perched on that round one down there eating it. Look at that. It's one that suet. That's a pretty bird. That looks like a woodpecker, a small one. Look at it. See how it picks through there? I hope y'all can see that. They love it. That looks like a little, some type of a woodpecker. There was a different one over here yesterday. That one doesn't have as long of a bill. It's not bothered by me. I like to see them eat that. It's good for them, especially in the winter. It's good for them. just not that many birds there it goes but I like to see him eat something that's why I added the suet to it suet to it that rhymes so you can see there is some ice on the bird bath
these plants in here are still kind of holding their own. Kale and those flowers. The poor little old tomatoes. I ought to just pull them up. I don't know. Trying not to swing the camera around too fast. It actually, you know, when I see a lot of, when I see videos where it's moving around real fast, that does make me dizzy. But I get carried away talking and doing things and I don't, it's like I forget about the camera sometimes. Zinnias look good. Pretty good. Pretty clear sky. Okay. We saw the one of the hawks yesterday when we were out riding around. <clears throat> so they, they just move around the area. I see one right now, come to think of it. I don't know if y'all can see it though. Straight up in that tree, it's a big one too. Unless that's an owl. There are owls around here. Uh, I've only seen them at night. One day I was sitting out here, I guess it was midnight, I was just, I was having a bad night. You know, anxiety, and sometimes I come outside and sit. Well, I was sitting in the garage in my chair, and a monstrous owl landed on this gas post here. I, I mean, it was huge. And uh, it just sat there, and I would see its head move around. You know, and it, it saw me, it could easily see me. And uh, after a few minutes, it, uh, it flew this way around and then swung around here and flew within, you can see where that stool is right there. It flew that close to me. I mean, it came right in front of the garage and uh, it, you could hear its wings flapping. And that thing, I mean, I don't know how wide the uh, wingspan was, but I'm guessing three or four feet. I mean, it was it was big. The head was, I mean, bigger than a cantaloupe. The head was on it. But that's the only time I've seen it, I think one more time, and I've heard it out here, but you never hardly see it. See, so they hunt at night. As they can see in like total total darkness. It's amazing. And you know they're a lot skinnier than you think with when they when they like if they were to if you were to see them without their feathers and and everything, they're real kind of scrawny their body is compared to how big they look. They've got really big wings and feathers. Thick. I'm sure it keeps them good and warm. So we've got an amazing, we've got a real diverse amount of birds here. You know, especially in the summer, obviously. But in the winter, you, you see the ones that you don't really normally see as much in the summer, like these woodpeckers. That, that looked like some type of woodpecker we just saw. And uh, of course the hawks, you're liable to see them anytime. But uh, I like seeing all the different ones. I haven't seen blue jays lately. So I don't know if they've probably left the area. 
The next uh, bit of warmer weather, if we have like a little warmer spell, we'll go up here and walk around the uh, park up here. And hopefully tomorrow, uh, if you watched my drive, our drive with us yesterday, uh, we went up to that Rocky Mount when we took Logan to his therapy. It's a, got a museum in there. We've never been in there. We've lived, lived here all these years and never been there. But, uh, you know, that's a shame. But uh, we just don't get out and do much. But we're going to try to go back by there tomorrow and see... If we don't have time, they, it says they have tours, but if, they, if we, it takes longer than we have time, we might ask them, you know, or see when their a tour is that we could go. Uh, you know, maybe I could film it. Uh, I would imagine I could probably film in the uh, museum, if nothing else. So, something broke one of these off. Well, really, all things considered. Okay, you see my owl here. The one that I saw would make two of that. It, it would make two of this owl, the one I saw out here. And I'm not even kidding. I, about, I was shocked how big it was. But, um... Anyway, uh... Hope y'all enjoyed today's walk with me. I see my little friends over there bobbling around in the window. <laughs> Please press that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and hit that notification bell so that you get all my videos as soon as they come out. Everybody have a great day, and if nothing else, I'll see you later on on preview of the review. Bye everyone, God bless.